All right, guys, it's time for live duels with Machinas. They are wild. Their pure offense should be fun for live duels. We'll have to see how the quality goes. I have no idea at this point. Let's hope it's great. Hope you guys enjoy, and thanks for watching. All right, here we are facing a Rio. Let me guess we're going first. Oh, how did I know? We are always going first with the Machina. Always oh, using a heartbeat. Man, this guy is styling, guys. He is styling on us. Styling on us. So this is pretty basic. Just your fortress with the citadel. We even have a little kyroid to back us up if things go really, really bad. So not the most exciting hand, but the plays are simple. He's at 30 cards though. But, you know, he's he's got a taste in mats, so not much we can do. Now, if this is a heavy Ooh, wait. This can't be heavy traps with Valkyrie. Did he just mill another Citadel? Desperado? Okay. Okay. You animal. You want to make some animal plays? I'll show you some animal plays. Here comes the Kite Roy. You get a Floodgate the Kite Roy? I would love to see you do it. You sort of swing at her. Look at that. Kite Roy's about to get a kill in this deck. He's ready. Oh, should we link? Oh, we're gonna link. Snap. So there's a few things we could do. We could do this link and attack a back row. Or we could just swing a kite roid, swing them, go crazy. Or we could bring out this gimmick puppet. If he ever gets destroyed, we get the Desperado. We'll bring the fortress right back out with a citadel. Yeah, we might do that. But I mean, we could do that with the Phoenix. We could get the Phoenix out, crush a back row, then still get out the... I'm not too worried about the back row, though. If he's got a lot of traps in a Valkyrie deck, we're gonna be okay. So I'm gonna... I'm gonna play... less aggressive, more to the future of the Desperado. If, if that makes sense. And we're gonna have all three Citadels... in the graveyard. So pretty gnarly. Man, if he if he removes us without destroying us though, it's gonna be a bad look. But we got fortress still, so we're okay. We're okay. This is a lethal amount of damage as well. There's the floodgate. My guy. Why didn't you floodgate that kite roid? Why didn't you floodgate that kite roid? Yeah, see I wasn't too worried about his traps. I'll even kamikaze. I will kamikaze this boy, you don't even know. You don't even know. Oh, he did it for me. We're gonna pop him right in the mouth too. Nope. There we go. Pop! So now he could do something. Valkyries can do something. He might have a skill to draw or something. Oh no, I don't know why he's using Rio then. So they can do something. Oh, he's not though. Oh, why am I getting delays? Ooh, super team buddy force, huh? Should we just swing? Nah. Let's try to hit for two. Ah, oh, we hit one. Oh, we can't even hit the face down anyway. That's okay, though. Still in top deck mode. Still where he was at. There's that zero monster. Can Citadel be summoned by Super Team Buddy Force? I don't know that he can. Well, maybe. It says by card effect. Whatever, if he targets one of my cards, we're swooping it. You do not target my cards with that. He's not. He's not going to target my card. Wow, I'm kind of insulted. You wanted a... What? Why wouldn't you bring out a Citadel? You got a 1x Seas? That's crazy. What is this doing? What is going on? I'm turning my toggle on out of fear. What is, what is this Valkyrie doing? What is this Valkyrie doing? 
we gotta turn our toggle on out of fear, guys. Out of sheer fear of the Valkyries. Whoa, he does have a 1x seize. Or is that a link? Oh, it's a link. Gonna bust his boy up even more. And lower me. Look at him go. You animal. You gotta get past the, the hand of fate, though. Lady Luck, my guy. You gotta get past Lady Luck to do anything. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Toggle's on out of fear. Oh, we got two. We got them both. We did it, boys. We got him. Back to full strength. You gotta give me a scoop. Oh no, Hoshengen has an effect. Discards. Man, Hoshengen's a pretty pretty good uh, boy to bring out, huh? What do you think that back row is? We can turn the toggle out of fear off. Oh, he's got a scoop for it. Hey, I'll take it. Save me some time, guys. Save me some claps. Valkyries are something I haven't seen in a good long time, though. So, uh, pretty cool. Cool stuff. Sheena, guys. Super strong. Super cool. They're the boys. Great, great stuff. Alright, here we are going second against a little Jesse. Got a pretty cool sleeve and mat combo over there, though. I'm not gonna lie, that's like that. Uh, oh no, what is that? Is that that spring card or like a force? Pretty cool. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling that uh, sleeve or mat, guys. Let me know what that mat is so I can sh check if I have it. I feel like it's like that spring card. You guys know what card I'm talking about? It does like healing or something. Is our boy gonna let us duel here? Starry Knights. They just got something new, right? I think they just got a card trader trap. Like a one of. They're a tricky deck to fight, but uh, it should make for a good back and forth versus Machina. We'll see. So, what we're gonna do, we're gonna search a fortress, throw the fortress away with redeployment. He can disrupt us at any moment, though, and that could be that one of card. It's a trap card. I don't know what it does exactly, but it, it could be pretty wild. So, we're gonna search fortress. Then we're gonna throw Fortress away with redeployment. You with me? We're gonna grab another Fortress. You with me? Grab another Fortress. And we even have a gear for him to follow up. Do we want another Citadel? No, probably clear for him. So now, so we're gonna throw the Kite right away too. We're going all over the place. Okay, boom, so he's gonna throw himself in the kite roy. We probably could have thrown away the clear form, but it is what it is. Uh, we're just gonna swing this animal now, guys. So the back row is something. No, it's not, so what does that do? Brings out his boy, Starry Dragon, that's gonna pop one. A damage step, so I don't think we'll get Fortress's discard effect. Oh, he went for the gear. Why'd he go for the gear frame? Maybe he was afraid of the, the Fortress's effect, I guess. I'm gonna redo this attack. Hit the dragon and hit the back row, too. Let's see if we can do that. What is he waiting on though? He still gets to... Is it that trap? Is that trap like a really good negate? I haven't looked. It's limited to one. I'm assuming it's searchable and I'm assuming it's really good. So we'll have to see. There it is. That's it. Yeah, that's it. What is that gonna do? Oh, it's, it is it is just a big negate. Interesting. Rough turn for him there, though. See what he can do with three cards. We know one's his dragon. That was the blast, though. That was the card I was talking about, though. So let's see. Dang, that was a good top deck. Yeah, he played it immediately. Great top deck, my guy. Yeah, this is it. When your opponent activates a card or effect, return one level 7 dragon. If you do, negate it. If you do, destroy it. Only once per turn. So yeah. Interesting. Here he's getting more searches, more 
more of uh, all that stuff. This will be more of the same. We're gonna get our third fortress out too, guys. This would be a, be a wild one. Unless he's able to stop a fortress here. We'll see. XCs? Are they XCs? Sorry, I don't think they're Link. Definitely not Synchro. So do you have XCs? Sure is taking his time. But I'm sure it's a pretty... I know it's a pretty tricky deck. Not us, we're, we're just... Blast forward, guys. Let's go. That's all we do. Come on, my guy. You're trying to. I mean, hats off to him. He's trying to really think it out so he can get away all these fortress effects, which is something people usually don't do, and get around the citadel. So. I just wish he would commit a little faster. It's gonna be a long duel. It's gonna be a back and forth duel. Come on, come on, my guy. You can do it. There he goes. He does have XCs. Utopia. Utopia. I mean, it ha you have to have follow-up though, you can't stop it, Utopia, you have to layer it or whatever they- Layer Xyz, whatever that's called. Nope. Staying at the, uh, yeah, that's, uh... It's gonna turn out to be a problem for you, my guy. We're gonna be able to stop that in a single turn. Look at that, three fortresses, isn't that wild? Isn't that wild? The middle boy. Oop. Goodbye, clear form. Why do I keep calling them clear form? It's mega form. And then we're swinging, guy. We are, we are swinging for you. Here we come. We're gonna swing through Utopia. Now, does he get Starry Night effects? We, you have to have a Starry Night monster, right? I'm assuming. Do they get effects for being used as uh, material or? Now what's the worst that can happen? He lets it go through and we'll hit him with this fortress so it can't be destroyed. If he were to just try to mad lad us and let it go through. But no, this one will go through for lethal, correct? Because he just pops. Or does he have another trick up his sleeve? No, so he is able to use that. How is he just able to use that? Perplex. Who are you gonna pop? You can't pop him. Throw that away. Yes, continue to it. Man, he is, uh... He's in a rough spot. Let's see what he can do with, uh, one card. I hope it wasn't a monster. Oh, there you go, guys. Big claps with the fortresses on the field. We could even do more. We could even normal summon this. Bring a fortress back out. We still got... How does he have enough? He has a delay. What does he have? What do you get? What do you got? Show us what you got, my guy. He's not going to show us. How are we ever going to know? Oh my goodness. We're never going to know. We got to go look at his deck. Alright. Well, let's go. let's go see... All right, here's a little Yugi. We're going first. I'm always, it feels like I'm always going first with Machina. We got two Kyroids and a Gear Frame. This is one of the lesser hands you could have, and it's still not that bad. The Super Buddy's a little wasted for now, but it's all right. Up on our boy. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. 
pretty strong field, especially when you consider we have three instances of Kite Roy. One in his extra deck, though, that worries me. What? What is this? Was Did he use a skill? He did not use a skill, and it would show us if he was Black Luster, right? So let's see. Don't mind my stretch. What's he got? Dark Magical Veil! Do we want to summon Kyroid? No. Who's he bringing out? The old Dark Magician himself. You know, if you used a certain skill, you would be able to normal summon a Dark Magician. Wouldn't that be wild? I think he has the skill, too. Or he's able to have the skill. Sets a card, too, no less. Huh. Alright, my guy, there's a few things we can do. We can bring the gear frame off, we can kamikaze, hit him with the- ooh. Ooh. Oh, man. There's a few ways we can do this. Okay. Let's- let's figure this out so we can finish the door. So I could bring out the gear frame. Normal summon the kite roid. Go into the Link Monster? Kamikaze the Link Monster. Okay, keep up with me. Kamikaze the Link Monster into the Dark Magician. That brings out Desperado Barrel Dragon. We then... Because then I'll need to... No, we might have to... Because we can just bring the Barrel Dragon out. Yeah. Let's just get lucky. We're, I'm overthinking everything. We'll just go like this. Bing. Then we'll go. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll just. We got nothing to worry about, right? He doesn't have an effect veiler, right? We're okay, right? Would have liked to get him in the graveyard somehow before, but he's here. Let's use this effect. Oh no, we had it. I could have just swung and had lethal. Oh, man, that's uh, that's unfortunate. But we're okay. Because if I would have just swung, we could have just swung over that. Swung over. Mm, yeah, because I I still would have swung there. Would have been he. He was just waiting for the scoop anyway. Whatever that was. So uh. Machina guys, I love them. They're super fun, super fun to play. Live duels are great. Uh, um, I, don't know. I don't know what else to say. There's so much to mix them with. They need their own skill. She has a lot of skills for level 10 Earth Machines, but we don't really focus on that. We don't even have a lot of XCs. Give Machina a skill, guys, and we'll really clap off. But I uh, hope you guys enjoyed, and thanks for watching.